The winter storm hitting the southern U.S. surprised an Austin, Texas resident this week who found the net surrounding his trampoline completely coated in ice. That's so crazy. Freezing rain in the south has left thousands without power and turned roadways into ice rinks. Conditions that had people like this Memphis, Tennessee resident concerned for their livelihoods earlier this week. I'm a Lyft driver, so yeah, I kind of feel I was going to get out and make some money today, but after seeing a couple cars on bridges, you know, hit some black ice, I didn't want to get out there today. More than 450,000 homes and businesses in Texas, Arkansas, Mississippi, and Tennessee were without electricity early on Thursday, according to PowerOutage.us. Icy roadways across the region were blamed for eight deaths over the past several days, CBS News reported. And now the Northeast is bracing for an historic deep freeze. Wind chills are expected to plunge from northern Pennsylvania to Maine starting early on Friday and through Saturday evening. In New Hampshire's Mount Washington State Park, atop the Northeast's highest peak, temperatures were expected to break records with possible wind chills of minus 110 degrees and wind speeds topping 100 miles per hour. The frigid blast may feel especially jarring after weeks of unseasonably warm weather in some areas. The deep freeze, however, is not expected to bring excessive snow, a relief to areas like northern New York State, which saw record snowfall in late December. Mild temperatures are headed back to much of the Northeast starting on Sunday, according to the National Weather Service.